begin the Madera Minutes by highlighting the District Summer School. Madera Unified hosted an in-person enrichment summer school program at 27 school sites this summer. Students had the opportunity to explore camping, robots, rocket launches, cult treats, and much, much more. They enjoyed the opportunity to be back at school and in the classroom with friends. Many administrators said they were happy to see the excitement the students had during all the activities. On Friday, July 2nd, Madera Unified hosted a summer graduation ceremony in honor of its newest high school graduates. Overall, there were a total of 42 graduating students, 26 from Madera South High School, 6 from Madera High, 4 from Madera Adult School, 5 from Furman High, and 1 from Mount Vista. Not only were these students celebrated because of their accomplishments, but they were commended for their hard work and their ability to persevere during a difficult time for us all. Just get the work done. It's worth it in the end. Majera Unified alum came together at a Fresno Police Department swearing-in celebration in downtown Fresno on June 18th. Fresno City Council member Nelson Esparza, a Madera High School alum, joined two newly sworn in officers, Charles Bravo, alum of Madera South High School 2014, and Stephanie Pantoja, alum Madera High School 2015. Congratulations to you both. We would like to conclude by commending all the district staff that came together and helped make the 2021 high school graduation ceremonies available live in real time for the first time ever on the Madera Unified YouTube page. The important decision to make the events available online was so families who could not attend due to capacity protocols set by the Madera County Department of Public Health could still see the students being celebrated. The live broadcast received a huge audience with Madera South High School receiving over 10,000 views, Madera High receiving 6,500 views, and the alternative high schools receiving nearly 1,000 views. It would not have been possible without district staff working in the background such as the IT department coordination from the communications department, the high school activities directors, and staff who provided last minute equipment to make the graduations even more special.